Hey boys, what's going on? We are back with another Madden 23 Ultimate Team video. Today, we are going to be doing a side-by-side -side comparison of Pro Elite versus Pro Game Day packs to see which one we feel is hotter, is better, the better pack to be pulling. Um, if you are interested in pulling packs, um, there's not a whole lot to be chasing after, so maybe you pump the brakes on packs, but that's what we're here for. Um, and we're also uh, did get our content schedule for this week, so we're going to be going over that. And with all that being said, let's get right into it. So our content schedule, um, we are going to have team of the week for week 16 and 17. My guess is tomorrow. We don't know the exact dates. Um, we just know what we're getting. Um, and when EA takes their break, they do two weeks in a row together. Um, so that's kind of how that works. Um, so and then 18 will be probably next week, I guess. Um, but usually there's two sets of sometimes I don't know if there's two sets of packs or if it's one pack that you get both players. Uh, but there should be two LTDs, maybe like four heroes, champions, whatever. Uh, so we'll be getting into that this week as well. Um, season three on the field pass is coming out. Then we're going to have our playoff promo. Um, my guess would be Thursday or Friday on that, as well as obviously Legends on Saturday. So I don't really get a chance to go over the content schedule too much. But I saw it and I figured we don't have a whole lot we're, we're doing today, so let's do it. Um, so Pro Elite and Pro Game Day Packs. We're going to kind of do like maybe two of each and then kind of bounce back and forth, see which one we feel is better. The Pro Elite is a little bit more expensive, so got to account for them costing 8,000 more coins. Uh, I mean, we're getting some decently okay pulls. Um, nothing like insane right there um and we'll keep the legerius sneen just sell him off stack up some training for whenever there's training rolls or variety packs come back hopefully variety packs come back with season three um or if there's some sort of maybe wild card playoff ltv we got that 92 is a nice pull um or if there's some sort of yeah training role with playoffs for ltvs or anything like that um we'll definitely be um prepared and ready to dive right into it um hey 88 base elite pull out of the pro game day pack we'll take that for sure and 84 reggie white we get that animation a lot more animations in this pack like not as high of a pull but a lot like we've got 7700 training back um so still probably not the greatest coin to training ratio so i wouldn't be opening these packs necessarily just to stack training um i know i'm quick selling a lot of it this is not the best training ratio you could get yeah i could probably be better off selling everything off individually but i'm just no i'm not gonna do that um some some of the higher overalls yeah but like selling 80s 81s 82s is gonna be some you're gonna get a better training ratio back but it's gonna be a, a pretty decent um commitment there so just like with even gold you can exchange it there's other stuff you could be doing that it's gonna be more profitable for you guys so do as i say not as i do in this situation we're just here to see which pack we feel is more worth it and we've gotten the bigger pull so far which was that 92 Thai law out of the pro elite but i feel like we're getting i mean you're guaranteed all elites out of the pro game day so obviously we like the fact that it's all elites get more chances more slots for something good but i guess it's got a lower lower floor or probably lower overall ceiling i'm i'm losing i'm losing it in my upstairs guys sorry um but like, if I'm just ripping packs, like, I don't know if, if you were to sell this off, am I going to get 50k back here? The 89 is going to help, but I don't think I'm getting necessarily a full 55k back. So, neither of these packs are probably going to be the most super, super profitable, but we're like, if you're, if you're chasing something big, like, which pack is it? Um, and maybe it's none of these packs. Maybe it's one of the smaller packs. But maybe we maybe we can just pull like a 95 or 96 overall legend out of one of these and then we'll just say that that pack's goaded. Hopefully. 
And there's also going to be the potential for like ripping packs like these and then converting your training. If you do quick sell into like training roles and maybe like there's some profit over on one of those training roles, maybe campus heroes. I'm not sure. I've not done any of the research or math on that. I'm not going to, not going to lie to you guys. I'll be completely transparent and honest. Like I always am. So I mean, that would have been a great pack a couple months ago. Pulled Herbie and, and some nice, uh, UK cards. It's, it's unfortunately it's now January, so that's not the pack we want in January. We want to see like ninety pluses, or like there's no LT, so that's pretty much what we want to see is big pulls. Which unfortunately we're not really getting any big pulls, but there's never a guarantee on those. Legend animations can always be it, but then they can always be like a eighty overall power up. Mangold is a nicer pull there. I mean, nerf like every animation, but most of those were correlate anyways. Um, also, I believe that EA is starting to roll out make rights for some presents. Uh, I did not receive any. If I did, I would be opening it for you guys. Um, I feel like make rights are owed. I was, I was on during that window in which you were supposed to get like the glitch packs or whatever, and I did not get any, but I got what I was supposed to on my pack, so I'm not going to sit here and complain um, because I didn't get a chance to, to break the system. It's just... It's, ni it's nice to, to be able to capitalize on EA's errors, but it's... It's not necessarily... I'm not banking on it. All right. Legend. Big. 83 at water. 85. Can we get one more 90 plus pull before we wrap things up? Um, so you guys have seen kind of what I've gotten. I don't feel like one pack is necessarily any better than the others. Um, they're getting all elite pluses out of the pro game days. Uh, we got our biggest pull out of the pro elite over here. Hey, 92. So we got two 92 pulls out of the pro elite. So maybe that pack's a little bit better, but if I'm just sitting here to rip some coin packs, I'm probably going to do the regular game day, uh, just between, um, me and you guys. Uh, that's the pack that I would most likely lean towards, but we're going to do one more of each before we wrap things up here. See, maybe we get lucky at the end. We did get a 90, so we'll take the 90 Richie Grant. And final pack here, one pro elite. Since we've gotten two 92s, can we get a third 92 or better? EA? 89, Walter Payton. Sweetness. That's our second Justin Jefferson pull. And no. All right, boys. Well, that was that. Um, you guys can decide which pack you feel is better. We got Team of the Week should be coming out tomorrow. Uh, we got the wild card playoff uh, season three of the field pass and new legends coming out this week. So thank you so much for checking out this video. I appreciate it. I love y'all stay safe and I'll see you real soon.